Mm-hmm. It's closing in! I think we have a few minutes before he gets here. SpongeBob flips the binoculars. The propellers chop the potatoes. A fish looks up. Hey, it's raining fries. It's gonna take a lot more than potatoes to bring this baby down. Our potatoes slam into the nose. Was in shear the wings. <laughs> oh, maybe not. Inside the crusty crowd, fish watch the plane go down. <laughs> Hi, everyone. <laughs> Wait a minute, Patrick, look! Hey! And how far is it? A tank dis- Hi, everyone. Ends on a parachute. Plankton loads a pickle in the bear. <laughs> oh. <laughs> well, crabs, you're certainly in a pickle now! <laughs> With the crusty crab in his sights, he launches the pickle. SpongeBob and Patrick in Doughboy helmets recoil in horror, then do a slow mo leap as the pickle explodes. Hey! Oh no, not pickle! This... It's raining pickles! Ha! <laughs> no, it's raining! The tank flattens him. Thanks. You're welcome! <laughs> Plankton drives the. <laughs> SpongeBob and Patrick are battered. They peek over the sandbags. SpongeBob gets on a phone. Get out of Hold the un- Well, it's gonna take a lot more than mayo to stop. He hits the mountain of mayo and explodes, splattering SpongeBob and Patrick. A pile of mayonnaise shakes, and out of it steps a gigantic. It's a tick plankton robot, with plankton controlling it from atop its head. Uh, I just remembered, I don't work for Mr. Crab. Patrick runs away. SpongeBob bolts, arms up. Mr. Crab, plankton's here, and he's got a giant. And the robot barks out. Frozen in its threatening stance, out of fuel. Oh, barnacles, I'm out of gas. Plankton inside. Bars fall on the windows. Steel doors slam shut, then close. Alarmed customers look around. The toilet slams shut. SpongeBob, join me, and we'll be rich and powerful until I eventually betray you. Uh, 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 join me! No, never! I'm on Team Krabs for life! Krabs pulls back the iron doors barehanded. <laughs> Plankton and SpongeBob play tug of war with us. <laughs> Recipe bottle. Disintegrates. What? Where'd it go? Wait. Up. Wait. Up. I, I don't know. It just disappeared. Why should I believe you, you lying liar? Normally I'd agree with you, Mr. Krabs, but this time he's telling the truth. It just vanished. It's true. <laughs> Krabs nabs plankton and tapes him to a trunk. <laughs> Mr. Krabs, I'm telling you, he's innocent. What are you gonna do, Krabs? Pour hot oil on me? Oh, your sweet cheeks. Bamboo shoots under my nails? No. Knock, knock. Knock, knock, jokes. I can do this all day, Krabs. Knock, knock. Oh, boy. Who's there? Jimmy. Jimmy who? Jimmy, back my formula, Plankton! Well... Stupid, but how is it torture? <laughs> you see, Jimmy. Oh, 
Oh, I get it. Plankton's eyes bug out. Grabs his calm under headphones. <laughs> Crabs' eyes are closed. SpongeBob runs wildly around the room as Plankton's eye widens in terror. A tower of a hundred SpongeBobs. Mr. Crabs, SpongeBob, zip it. So weird. Thank you, Squidward. The customers are getting restless. They're asking. Puns. They drop Squidward. I'm not your enemy! Plankton is your enemy! A picture of a Krabby Patty. So join me! Audience! Help get the formula back! And I'll give each and every one of you a free... We're not... Krabby Patty! <laughs> oh, no, wait! Even better, a slight discount! <laughs> to the turn bucket! But he didn't do it. Don't worry about the fall. I had it right Slide. in my greedy little mitts, and then poof! And now it's gone. Or any other gone. The other thing. It's gone forever. Oh, I was so close to gaining the people's respect slash feet. Um, Plankton. Oh, when will my frustration slash humiliation end? Plankton. This is gonna be a Not now, hon. I'm ranting slash raving. All right, what is it? Well, I was trying to tell you there is an angry mob outside, but now they're inside. Crabs, <laughs> you all look very Ourselves. hungry. Can I get anybody a chum burger? Get up with that nice and plated. This is the last time I'm going to ask you. Where is me? Formula. All right, Mr. Crabs, let me get in on this. So huh? you won't. Soap in the eye, eh? Wait a so, Derek! <laughs> oh, no! Oh, who? Yeah, I guess that's a short way of saying it. Stop that bubble! A crop. <laughs> follows beneath, hurling objects at the rising bubble. A football knocks it into a spin, and a muscle-bound fish throws a fellow citizen who clings to the outside. <laughs> Please tell me there's something soft below me. Nope. <laughs> Most no, I start ground. Seriously, aren't you overreacting a bit? The scene turns apocalyptic. Welcome to the apocalypse, Mr. Squidward. Wait a minute. The end. Uh, Appears as the credits roll. The gull grabs the pages in a tug of war with the pirate. Kill your legs, gull! <laughs> the pirate falls backwards through the deck. Feathers. I know I shouldn't be littering, but that ending was rubbish. The seagull drops the end page into the water and it sinks. It drifts down to the apocalyptic bikini bottom. Patrick enters a bleak version of the Krusty Krab. Uh, work. Put them together. What's a uh, uh, You know I can hear you, right? Yeah. Teamwork. Teamwork. <laughs> she. Patty's <laughs> <Eddie's> anywhere? <laughs> it's love! The secret ingredient is love! He switched. <laughs> He's a club. <laughs> If I'd have known that, I'd have chewed it slower. An object falls. They land. Hard. Hey, what's with... He 
brings lo oil. Come on, SpongeBob, let's get out of here. Patrick. Patrick sits on him. Patrick, what? <laughs> Why are you doing this? Because I need gravity, please. <laughs> off with plankton. The mob chases them, passing Patrick. <laughs> Am I still on? A team? To his behind. Hey, what are you looking at? SpongeBob holds plankton as he sprints away. They go into Sandy. His biodome airlock. Puts on a clear helmet and scoops plankton into a glass of water. Sandy. <laughs> he and plankton walk through a domed-in park, a giant tree at its center. <laughs> Sandy. Sandy. You. <laughs> Ransacked. Gary. This is this is this. He goes downstairs. Gary. <laughs> Green goo splats in his face. Revolting. But it means Gary is close by. This is private parts. Gary, I'm back. <laughs> Whoa. Gary sits high. What do you mean you don't have to do as I say anymore? He's going to help us with our... What do you mean, king of snails? Gary the snail, you get down here right now and join this team. A song about private parts. What do you mean, seize them? They're surrounded by dozens of <laughs> angry-eyed snails. They race out of the pineapple. Belongs only to you. Why are you running? Because they're right on our tail. <laughs> your pants cover up your pants. <laughs> they turn and see the snails in slow, slimy pursuit. <laughs> your pants belong only to you. All right, snails. Well, so much for your TM. <laughs> time. Bikini Bottom is still in flames while SpongeBob and Plankton watch from a bluff beneath the stars. Are you there, Charlie Bear? Everything we know and love has been destroyed. covers him with sea. This side. Pushes into the brain folds. Go anywhere. Huh? It's a candy world of smiling clouds and rainbows. Be anyone. Do this place. A waffle chases the syrup. Butch pie. Ice cream cones play. Ew, it's so sweet in here. It's... And I ran to find Grandpa. I think my eyeball is getting a toothache. Hello, Big cake cupcakes and the milkshake. <laughs> Riding a bike, towing a cookie. He can't escape, except for a birthday cake cliff. <laughs> Plankton bounces. From the ground around him arise white puff. Balls that come together. Let's do a tug of our break. <laughs> rise up ominously and assemble themselves into a giant kitty. <laughs> oh, so much sweetness. I think I'm gonna be sick. He vomits a sparkly rainbow with a face. It grins. Daddy. His eyes go glassy. He vaults out of SpongeBob's head. Oh, Plankton? Oh, Plankton, I just had the craziest... <laughs> ...dream. <laughs>
and you were in it. I'm sure it was nothing. He's covered in pink fluff. <laughs> now go back to sleep. Were you in my... Just in my brain? What? No, that's crazy talk. Assume every... Maybe, I don't want to... Just just to wait. I'm gonna be on the TM! <laughs> May I have a surprise for you? You think of that? But, Plankton, everything's better when you're part of a team. You're not gonna start singing, are you? Teamwork. Oh, brother. We can do anything when we have teamwork. Oops, I think you need to... Don't you think so, my friend? No, teamwork is getting in the way of my ski work. What don't you comprehend? But working together is the key. Nothing's impossible when it's you and me. I'm doing just fine on my own. Work is no fun when you do it alone. If I want it done right, I'll do it by myself. Super. But what if you need something on a higher shelf? I'm a target. Yeah. Never very scary, crazy, post-apocalyptic mob. Well, that's exactly why you need a partner helping you with this important job. I'll be the hammer, you'll be the nail. I'll be the boat, and you'll be the sail. I'm the fly. Oh, you're the aroma. Right now, I wish I was in a coma. Come on, I'm here for you and you're here for me. It's better when you plus me equals we. <laughs> Working together in harmony. Side by side, we can reach our dreams. Cause nothing's impossible when we're a team. All right, you can put me down. Well, that's one minute of my life I'll never get back. <laughs> Slow down. Now we're out of time, the sun is so short. Hmm. Yes. He jumped one of my victims on his head. SpongeBob, you're a genius. Oh, we. When we. As the. Patrick flops to the floor. Quick body. Plankton in pursuit. It bounces. Plankton bounces. SpongeBob chooses nails. Plankton toboggans atop the key toward the belly button. They bounce. Plankton catches it as it goes in Patrick's navel, but they descend into the navel anyway. SpongeBob snatches Plankton and the key out of the big belly button, waking Patrick. a whistle. No! Uh, 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 once upon a time, there was a big fat pink idiot who went to sleep. The end! Nice try, but it's gonna take more than a dungeon wall. He's been through my hard drive looking for the secret formula. <laughs> I never had it, but we're going to get it. We're going to go back in time to steal the formula before it disappeared. Time travel. Where are you going to find it? Light sweeps the restaurant. A cuckoo clock. Some day old chips. Now all we have to do is build it. Oh, no, you don't. My pitch pipe. Uh, I need it for the time machine. Oh, okay. He runs into the photo booth. Installed. Zoom up, zoom up, doop -doo -doo. <laughs> SpongeBob and Plankton take turns hammering a nail. They pour steel nuts, saw a railroad tie, and operate a screwdriver. This is Pankasaurus. He's going to help us with our song about Pankasaurus. SpongeBob eats a taco. Plankton, a sausage. They thread a needle and attach a hose. Plankton spins clock hands, and the machine starts up. I did it! No, we did it! Side by side, we can reach our dreams, because nothing's impossible. Okay, Plankton, this is it. He slams the off switch. 
and her monitor blinks 12 a.m. Like them? Are you crying? This is a giant plane of sand. Someone asked us. The two they have a plane of sand. Just tell them no. Right here! Right where it's... The sand dune blows away, and Patrick is seated on the crusty crab sign. The restaurant buried beneath. SpongeBob and Plankton race back to the time machine. A swirling kaleidoscope of squid tentacles and a bright portal of rotating sheet music bring them to a dark place with a shiny floor. Lights go on. A tall figure in a long, high color. robe watches the universe from a giant triangular window. I think we may be lost in time, Plankton. Maybe we should ask this guy for directions. It is my ancient dolphin. My kind. He floats into a dolphin-labeled restroom. From outside, they're floating in a two-dimensional prism. They watch Jupiter and Saturn in the midst of a swirl of stars. What are you doing? I'm watching. We don't even know what we're watching for. Maybe we should split up the workload. You watch the one with the big red eye, and I watch the one with the ringy thingies. Like a team. Oh. Planets collide in a huge galactic explosion throwing rubble. <gasps> I'm pretty sure that wasn't supposed to happen. Come on, Plankton. We gotta clean this up before Bubbles gets back. <laughs> he scurries to stack the rubble and trails a piece of Saturn's ring. And you... Lose your lives. Bubbles shoots a laser beam from his blowhole. SpongeBob and Plankton dodge it. They see the time machine. Hey, me! He flips them a coin, but a laser strike throws them into the time machine. SpongeBob grabs the quarter from the floor as the laser hits. The time machine starts, and they fall back through a tunnel of changing colors, then turn black against a white background. Crusty Crab. Friends, neighbors, brothers, and sisters. SpongeBob walks in on Plankton, switching the Krabby Patty formula. Hero is finally from your all-time favorite book. With an identical bottle holding a piece of paper. <laughs> Plankton <laughs> Holding the recipe. <laughs> Starts next Wednesday. Uh-oh. Any good. Get more Initiating lockdown sequence. Come on, SpongeBob. We gotta get out of here. <laughs> Got it. Come on. Holding the recipe bottle triumphantly, SpongeBob CITV sprints to the time machine, escaping the security lockdown. The time machine plunges. So I'll take a The pirate watches them go, then hears something. Bye bye, Mr. Poop. Now I can get my gold sticker. A seagull outhouse. Oh, hey, Mr. Pirate. I wouldn't go in there if I were you. <laughs> His feathers fly off. I can't fly without my feathers. A pigeon drives a taxi. Where to, Mac? Just drive. In Bikini Bottom, a burning tire rolls. to tear up the Krusty Krab, throwing tables with its jaws and breaking windows. SpongeBob and Plankton watch helplessly. Well, Plankton, I guess we failed to accomplish our goals. We? But even failure hurts a little less when you do it as a team, right? This is all your fault! Krabs is... speaks and i thought my friends were primitive spongebob sniffs don't cry me boy everything's gonna be fine that's right 
Keep thinking happy thoughts. No! Squidward snaps on an executioner's mask and swings his axe at a rope, releasing the weight above SpongeBob, who winces as it falls. The stone lands on the platform. Then Mr. Krabs lifts it off SpongeBob. The boy's right. He hurls the stone. I smell him too. Carrying off their apocalyptic outfits, the crowd follows him up a bluff. His nose detaches to follow the scent vapors. It's coming from over there. Everyone follows him. SpongeBob leads them through a barren valley below a cruise ship. <laughs> rotting on its side. He leads them through a snowstorm across the underside of. Gigantic branches on the edge of the moon and seated on the wings of an eagle. They go up a vertical rock face and stop at the crest. Come on, guys. I think it's just over this hill. They look up to the water's surface. Krabby Patty vapors waft down. How do you expect us to go up to the surface? We won't be able to breathe. All right. All secondary characters, come with me. Yeah. I'm with you guys. You play the other Hurts you. No! Finding it. Guys, if. No! Finding into some dolphin's mouth. Bubbles. Swims up and does a triple flip as he breaks the surface. His blowhole opens like a sunroof, and all his guests look up. What's happening? I feel tingly. Bubbles shoots them straight up through his blowhole. Then he spins, using his tail flukes to swat them onto a real beach. They're three-dimensional. I've done all I can. Ah. Triangular light. Ah, fresh air. Oh, how I've missed you. Yeah, this place smells awful. Come on, guys. Let's get the Krabby Patty formula and save Bikini Bottom. They trek through the sand among the crowd. Oh. Rimmel's all-new Lasting Finish 35 Hour, the UK's most hydrating longwear foundation. What oh, is this place? I have a bad feeling about this. Maybe this guy knows where we are. He looks smart. He's got five heads. Uh, sir, could you tell us where to find a Krabby Patty? Hey, my friend's talking to you. It's a bare foot. What? He peeks around it. <gasps> a giant hairy porpoise! A male sunbather. It's beached! It's suffering! Poor thing. Y'all, those aren't porpoises. All oh, hands on deck! <sighs> we need to get these guys back in the water! Come on! Push! They get against his back. He rolls back out racing beneath the sand and smack into a shovel they split up arriving at a little girl's sand castle invaders uh oh you get out of my sister's sand castle he kicks it hard and they go flying patrick lands on a pink ice cream cone crabs against a cotton candy cart sandy and spongebob on an umbrella and Squidward on a gorgeous sunbather's back. Patrick realizes he's on an ice cream. Where have you been all my life? He kisses him passionately, burying his head into the soft pink scoop. Squidward slips and slides on the girl's oiled back. Feels so good. Patrick's face down in the cone. Gross! The kid flings it and it nails Squidward. Oh, hey, Squidward. Sandy! The Krabby Patty. I'll pencil you in. I think I see where it's coming from. His running spins the umbrella. When the owner shuts it, the two slide down one of the folds. When he pops it open again, they're tossed into the air, sticking next to crabs on the cotton candy cart. They fall onto the dock. Sports At the end, they're...
in, they say. Suck it all in at once. Back to normal. Their eyes pop wide and their mouths are in a state of perpetual exclamation. Behind them sweep the cities of the U.S. and major world landmarks and wonders. From farther back, they're just standing as Sandy changes postcards. Uh, what is this sugar gonna wear off? They f skaters and bike riders. Sandy carries a terrifying... Patrick's face lights up with a smile as he licks the ice cream. <laughs> um, maybe we should have picked a better superpower for you, Patrick. The <laughs> Pirate grabs the book. Oh, let's see you get out of this one. Oh. <laughs> Krabs releases two jet-powered claws, <laughs> trapping Burger Beard. Get ready for the Invincible! He blows a large bubble, which engulfs the book and floats away. My book! All right, team. Time for hands in the middle. Yes. Oh, yeah. Krabs pulls back his claw as the pirate frees him. The self from the other one. with him at the wheel. Through his spyglass, he sees his book floating in the bubble. There she blows. <laughs> Patrick surfs on SpongeBob's back as he propels them with bubbles, swooping and turning in pursuit of the pirates. They pass Sandy and Krabs, but Burgerbeard sees them gaining on him in his side view mirror, which reads, objects appearing closer than you think. He hauls down the foresails and takes off. The ship goes airborne for a second, just missing a sports car. Krabs skids around the car in hot pursuit. 
as Burger Beard steers crazily down the street. SpongeBob takes in a chest full of air for a burst of bubbles. Patrick is close enough to reach for the ship. Oh, no, you don't. You sleep. Patrick grabs the side, kicking off SpongeBob, who propels himself into the crow's nest. He falls, grabbing Patrick's trunks and pulling them down to his butt crack. Burger Beard stomps a pedal, releasing the anchor, which takes out Patrick and SpongeBob and reels out Chain far behind the ship. spots the book bubble and scurries up the rigging. Behind him, towed by the anchor chain, Jane is everyone else, hanging on to crabs. He's after Beard strains for they pull hard toward everyone but crabs. That's what you get. <laughs> a trio of gulls watch, eating popcorn. The ship finally stops in a cloud of dust. As the mast teeters, Burger Beard slowly turns. The book bubble is tantalizingly close. Squidward blows the clarinet, sending an avalanche of sound waves toward the pirate and popping the bubble. The book falls below deck onto the open grill. It bursts. It's into flames. All right, Burger Beard, prepare to yeah. be teamwork. I'm gonna scrub my arm bits with you. Oh, yeah. Uh, I don't get it. Because you're a sponge. Oh. <laughs> oh. Get him, the rodent! Consider him roasted! Bystanders run as Sandy buries herself face first into a peanut cart. Leaping into the street, she spits them at the pirate. When he dodges them, she goes full peanut machine gun. He bats them away with a spatula. He grabs a rope and jumps over the side. Aw, nuts! I'm all out of nuts! The rope hauls him back into the crow's nest. He taunts her. Justice is best saved, served. A hail of ice cream cones shoots through the windows of an ice cream store and down the street. Patrick, I should have never doubted your powers! Burger Beard swings around the crow's nest on a rope. He's directing the ice cream cones at Patrick, who staggers back as they strike him. Splattered, he topples to the street. I can't think of a sweeter way to go. Holding up the tiny bottle. He's mine! Not um... Huh? Why aren't we off? So fast, Booker Beard! Crab swings his jet claws at the ship, shearing off the mast. Burger Beard falls. Which means the engine <laughs> won't work. The mast crashes to the street, and the tiny bottle with the formula rolls away from the ship. Crabs retrieves his jet claws and strikes a pose. This formula. These will make you feel a little butter. A horn-shaped butter gun. Which means... <laughs> he aims and sends crabs flying into the distance. Mr. Krabs! SpongeBob reaches for the bottle. Burger Beard yanks a lever and a dozen cannon barrels appear. <laughs> Uh-oh. He sets the bottle down. Burger Beard yanks on the handle, firing all the cannons. SpongeBob dodges the cannonballs with a narrow miss between his legs. Grandpa in my pocket! Lomo, a cannonball goes through the bubble wand above his mask and drifts harmlessly away. He leaps like a ballet dancer as we laugh and play. Today we dream what we could be. The cannonballs pass through the wand and float into the air. Burger Beard watches, fascinated, as he tugs the firing handle. Ta-da! 
funny. Cause we Spack, Patrick eats the last cone, watching a cannonball float above his face. They're beautiful. He bobs it. Team, my grump. And it falls on his face. Patrick! <laughs> Distracted by Patrick's injury, SpongeBob is smacked by a cannonball. The bubbles pop, and the other floating balls fall, leaving craters in the street where he lies. Burger Beard grabs the bottle. Where do you think you're going? Plankton peeks above the deck's edge. <laughs> Why don't you get going, little fella, before you hurt yourself? His one eye frowns and he ducks down. Then the ship trembles and rises. Plankton is now a hugely muscular green giant with a tiny head holding the ship. Plankton? Burger Beard swings vertically from the wheel. He climbs up on it and into the ship's hold, closing the hatch. Scowling, Plankton tosses the ship straight up, rendering Burger Beard weightless. Plankton flips it upright and spins it on one finger. Burger Beard slams to the wall, knives thudding around him from the force. Come out, come out, wherever you are! Burger Beard squeezes hot sauce in his eye. My eye! Plankton hurls the ship and grabs his face. It crashes on the street. Burger Beard clambers out of the smashed hold and tiptoeing at first, runs down the street past Spongebob. He's getting away! It could really use a name. Amelia! The monstrous plankton leaps over the ship. And a bunch of her friends. Ready for a blank ton of bubbles? Spongebob grins. Plankton grabs him, holds him up, yes. and blows through the bubble wand. A tidal wave of bubbles rumbles and crashes behind Burger Beard as he flees. It lifts him off his feet and carries him off, only to be plucked up by the collar, still running in place by Plankton. He goes limp. The formula, please. Come on. Let's hear it. Team up with me. We'll be rich and powerful. For the flawless five. Plankton runs and drop kicks the pirate into the horizon. Burger Beard crashes onto a small island with three palm trees. Buried up to his neck in the sand, a seagull lands on his head. The beach. Can we do hands in the middle again? Yes, we can, Patrick. But this time, there's one more hand to go in the middle. He gestures toward Plankton, who doesn't join the circle. Plankton? Sponge so because of Luffy. <laughs> Bob looks and finds him staring at the formula bottle. Plankton dangles it in front of his eye, then reaches down. Here you go, Krabs. She's all yours. This doesn't have a cell. When that something is the Krabby Patty. Okay, everybody, let's get back to Bikini Bottom and... Oh, no! I don't have the page! Oh, no! It must be back on Pelican Island! Don't worry! I thought of everything. All right, SpongeBob. Take us. I'm really bad about this. Oh, thanks. It's the page. Squid, what? But look at... Oh, yeah. Come on. Oh. It's time to go back and open up the Krusty Krab. Are you out of your patty flipping mind? I'll never leave this place. Wait a minute. You... What? No. And your flashlights... He disintegrates and comes back in two dimensions at the Krusty Krab. Well... It was fun while it lasted. The others appear. Don't be sad, Squidward. I left you a little surprise. Under your shirt. Squidward lifts his shirt. Rock hard abs! Aw, oh, SpongeBob. You're okay in my book. Aw, oh, shucks. Excuse us. We'd like 3,000 Krabby Patties, please. Customers swarm the Krusty Krab. That sound must mean things are back to normal. Who wants 3,000 Krabby Patties? They release balloons over the Krusty Krab. First one's for you, Gary. Extra mayo, just the way you like it. Mom. Gary snatches it. Aha! <laughs> uh -huh. Caught you red-handed. Gary hates mayo. Plankton, up to your old tricks again already, eh? Hey, I'm just putting things back the way they were. What do you have to say about this, Gary? Oh, shrimp. A snail chase as snarling Gary... Gary pursues a terrified Plankton Gary. See you later, TMA. <laughs>
SpongeBob waves oh. as Squid Horace tries to eat a burger with his short arms. Now can we sing it? Yeah. The gulls surround Burger Beard. Please, Mr. Pirate. Oh, Kyle. He gives him a sincere look. What can I say? Are you ready? With a brush, reaches <laughs> across and turns the scene into a cartoon with the original pirate from the TV show. The seagulls sing the response. If not a nonsense, be something you wish. Then drop on the deck and flop like a fish. From a triangle in the sky, a cartoon bubbles pokes his head in the scene. I don't like that song, and I put an end to it. Well, this music is terrible. I suppose you're entitled to your... Wit. Why am I talking to you? You're an inferior species. Oh, wow. What could you know about taste? You get excited by a pile of trash on a plate. While I'm a space-time traveler, fabric on rubber Saving the patties in the past, but now I'm rapping, yeah. That song's so bad that I can't even stand it. Dispense with this nonsense. <laughs> At one I demand it. You all stand no chance against my power. Don't try it. Just sit there with your flappy big shot and be quiet. Hold <laughs> oh, the fish guts. <laughs> <laughs> Can't insult us. The seagull crew. Well, we're in no mood to hear from you. <laughs> wow. <laughs> we're flying on the breeze. Party in seven seas. You got your nose on your head. You blow up when you sneeze. Why is this guy so mean? Because he's older than a fossil. All alone up in space. Yeah, that must be awful. Yeah. <laughs> You're making the movie too. Why don't you take us back in time so we can finish our song? Fine. Bubbles disappears. Whales, elephants, and cannons appear as a biplane tows a sign reading SpongeBob SquarePants. Bubbles returns from the sky. That was pretty good, actually. Directed by Paul Tibbetts. Screenplay by Jonathan Ibell and Glenn Berger. Characters led by SpongeBob dance across the bottom of the screen. Story by Steven Hillenberg and Paul Tibbetts. Based on the series SpongeBob SquarePants. Created by Steven Hillenberg. Live action direction, Mike Mitchell. Produced by Paul Tibbetts. Produced by Mary Parent. Executive producer, Stephen Hillenberg. Executive producers, Kale Boyder, Nan Morales, Craig Sost. Dance is so last year. Director of photography, Phil Mayhew, BSC. Production designer, Luke Freeborn. Edited by David Ian Salter, ACE. Music by John Debney. Creative supervisor, Vincent Waller. Art directors, Peter Bennett, Reuben Hickman. Co-producer, Lori J. Nelson. You know what this means. A little interpretive dance. Associate producer, Jenny Monica. Costume designer, Roland Sanchez. Antonio Banderas. Tom Kenny. Tell me, shine like a chain and wipe it up. Clancy Brown. Stain, upper cut, yep, a game and double dutch. Rock. Roger Bumpus. Do it to you, rum it again. Bill Fagerbach. So refreshing. Would you believe me? Carolyn Lawrence. Mr. Lawrence. Role as the characters march in the other direction across the screen.
stars skim across a lake towards a distinctive pyramid-like mountain with a snow-covered peak. The stars form an arch over the mountain. Paramount. A Viacom company. Skimming across the water, it's suddenly airborne, racing out over tropical small islands to the broad ocean. The kelp drape words, Nickelodeon movies rise from the sea in a rush of foam and spray, then plunge back again, moving on to the broad ocean. Everything stops and jogs to the left, where sits a solitary little island. Three palm trees jut out amidst a cluster of green vegetation, where the view cuts through the jungle and halts at a beach. A man pulls a lifeboat on the sand, dragging an... Ernest Borgnine. Gary chases plankton at a snail's pace across the bottom of the screen. form an arch over a distinctive pyramid-like mountain. Paramount, a Viacom company.